Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today we are going to be doing the Wendigo sandwich, and I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Uh, famed author Chuck Wendig came up with this sandwich after he tried peanut butter and pickle, a combination I love, um, and did a video a while back. And this one uh, adds some new elements to it, which is pretty interesting. And if you go to his website at terribleminds.com, he's got tons of variations for you to try out too. It's pretty cool. And uh, shout out to whoever recommended this on TikTok. I didn't save the screenshot I thought I saved. Uh, so I don't know how to properly tag you, but thank you. All right, on one piece of bread, we use Duke's mayonnaise. And on the other piece of bread, peanut butter. Then on the peanut butter, pickles. And on the mayonnaise side, bacon. Okay, let's give this Wendigo sandwich a go. Wow. So I've had the peanut butter and dill pickle. I've had bacon and mayonnaise sandwiches. I've never had all of this in one sandwich, and it's good. <laughs> You get the smokiness of the bacon, the punch of the dill, the richness of the mayonnaise, and the delicious nuttiness of the peanut butter. That is good. I'm half tempted not to plus it up, but I'm going to add one more element that I think will take it over the top. <laughs> Sorry, Chuck. Hope you're not offended. Going for a little sriracha. All right, let's give this plussed up Wendigo sandwich a go. I dig it. The sriracha is bringing a little bit of sweetness and definitely a little heat. Those were the only elements that were missing, if this was missing anything at all. So, oh man. So the original sandwich, I'm going to go ahead and give it a 9. That was tasty, 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 all on its own. Then I gilded the lily with a little sriracha sauce. 10, baby. You got sweet, heat, smoke, dill, nuttiness, richness. Mmm. I'm definitely going to finish that for lunch. All right. See you next time. Give this Wendy go. Go. <laughs>